Hello, everyone. Today we are going to talk about, yes, you guessed it, scale plot product attention. And to better get the intuition behind it, we are going to implement it together uh, using mainly PyTorch. And I am leaving the code in the description and you can just check it out. Okay. Let's start with the scale plot product attention. So it is important to understand this concept, this attention mechanism, because it is, uh, it is the foundation of the transformer architecture. All right. Now I am in the attention is all you need paper. And it is actually can be explained with just two figures. The first one is this function. Okay. This is the scale that product. Uh, attention function. This is actually just um, that product attention. Uh, that product attention, okay, is identical to algorithm except this DK in square root. What this is is it is uh, the scaling value. Uh, what it does is basically if we don't have that, okay, softmax softmax function. Uh, can go into the places where it has extremely small gradients. But when, if we normalize it using this uh, scaling value, we just counter that problem. So that's why we have this. And other inputs are the qu query, key, and value. But what does the other parts do? Okay, this uh, dot product uh, decides how close the query and key vectors are. The closer they are, the higher dot product value they will get from here. And after that, we divide it by the scaling value, like we discussed, and we take a softmax function. With this softmax function, we uh, we make them make the values between zero and one. And finally, with this next multiplication, uh, what we do is if we have a higher uh, that product value with query and case, the value that corresponds to query and key multiplication will have a higher attention, will have a higher weight. And if this previous matrix multiplication between query and case is lower, the corresponding part from the value vector will have a lower weight. And Q, K, V are basically query, key, and values of this attention. And there is a specific way of implementing this. And it is actually shown very easily in the paper, which is like this. Okay this figure on the left, this one. So what we're going to do is basically take query and K and do a matrix multiplication, okay, here. And after the matrix multiplication, we will do a scaling. And uh, this is the here, this part, okay. And we will have an optional masking. We will do all of them in the coding part two. We will mask it optionally. Uh, for short mask is basically the part that we don't give, want to give our attention to. And we will set it to minus infinity, preferably. Uh, it is, as you can see, we are going to set it a very small number since we can do minus infinity. And we will apply the soft match. And last, last, we will uh, matrix multiplication with the value. Okay, this is the, this is how we are going to, this is how the scale dot product attention works, basically. And it is important since we are going to stack them and use them as the basic building blocks of multi-head attention. And it's going to be a basic building block of uh, the transformer architecture.
something that may confuse you is that the term self-attention and everything here is actually a self-attention okay also called intra-attention uh basically the transformer is using the architecture of stack self-attention okay basically whatever we do here goes under the category of self-attention see multi-head is also a self-attention mechanism as long as it is inside the transformer we can call it self-attention okay now let's implement uh, scaled dot product attention first we are going to need a math module we are going to need the torch module and we are going to need uh, the functional from uh, PyTorch. And we can import it as F. Okay, uh, let's define our function. We will have at we will have four arguments, K query value and query k value and optional mask all right so in order to track the size the size of the tensors uh, alongside the function and to better illustrate the matrix multiplications let's do something like let uh, query k and value size the three to two okay this is for illustration purposes first let's ex extract the scaling value which is the uh which is the dimension of the column of query which we can find it like this okay scaling value now we will start the first matrix multiplication metmul matrix multiplication same thing so we will do a matrix multiplication between query and key however we can't do it like this because uh, let's say the query has the dimensions three to two okay and the key has a dimension three to two we cannot do a matrix multiplication between these two matrices so we are going to transpose the k matrix what it does is with the dimensions minus two to minus one okay what it does is basically it takes this dimension and turns it into two to three now we can do a matrix multiplication and as a result we will have three to three metrics okay this is the first metmol step okay now it is time for the scaling step which we are going to do with we are going to take attention logics and divided by square root of the scaling value square match that square root and the k okay we can uh, see it from the function how the scaling is done this is the scaling step okay now it is time for the optional masking step so if there's mask, we are going to check it with this statement. And let's give a brief, brief information about mask. So what do we mean by mask is with masking, we give a units very small values so that attention won't apply to them okay for example if we have paddings we will mask them and we will give them very minimal values minus infinity 
in theory, but as long as it is small, it's okay. So that we want to include them in computations and training or whatever. We want to include them in anything. That's why that's what we are trying to achieve. And uh, let's again attention log it. And we are going to use a function called mask fill. So what it's going to do is we have this mask, okay, as an input. And it will take this mask and it will turn it into a true and false tensor. If it has zeros in the tensor, the original mask tensor, it will turn them into uh, trues here and the others false. And this function will take those trues and replace them by the value we are going to give here. They are going to replace the trues with this. So basically we uh, take the mask, make the, make the zeros true and replace them with this and the masking is complete. Okay. And let's add that uh, smaller the mask value better. Okay. For now, we are still have the same uh, matrix dimensions. And now it is time for the soft max step. For that, we are going to use um, PyTorch uh, functional module. We give attention logits and we want it to calculate alongside the axis a dimension minus one. Okay. It is the softmax step. And lastly, we have the last matrix multiplication, the last mat mode. Okay. We are going to do it like again, torch mat mode, attention logits, and the value. And let's check if we have any problems with uh, metric sizes. So attention logits at last time here at the dimension three to three. And our value dimension, like we said here, as a sample, has three to two. So we can make matrix multiplication with these two matrices and the result would be three to two. Okay, so everything is fine. And this is softmax step. And let's return it. Okay, so everything seems fine for this function. Uh, let's actually try if it works or not. So let's create a main function equals the main and we have query torch that random m three. Let's make the sample inputs the same as uh, our uh, our beginning initial matrix values, so that it is better. Uh, it is easier to understand. And let's do the same for k and value okay and then let's call our function attention equals the scaled dot product attention query k and value and let's print the attention okay well, let's save it let's run it okay we have a syntax error here this is supposed to be is let's run it again and scaled that's another syntax issue here this is scaled that product attention okay yeah as we can say we have the attention output and it is the same size as uh, we expect it to be and actually let's print it size too 
uh, and everything seemed just fine. Yeah, everything is working. So if you, I will put the code on GitHub in description and thank you.